I think if it's if it's something I'm learning for the first time, I I like to really tear it down and work uh, brick by brick. So the first thing I really look at is the text, the libretto, and I look how things are uh, done uh, with with the uh, the grammar, with the um, the notation of it, whether it's a question mark or an exclamation point, that will make me want to deliver the sentence or the word much differently. Like a good example is like we did Tosca too, um, and and uh, the sacristan says twice "vuoto" empty when when they bring out the basket from the church, and and the first time Puccini's marvelous at this, but the first time it's "vuoto" and there's a question mark. And then he says it immediately again, and it's an exclamation point. So you, you have to look at that and say, well, I have to deliver that that way, question, and then, def, you know, demonstratively, voto. So that, those are all little clues that you that you first need to find uh, in, the, in the text. And then you look at it uh, within the framework of the melody and how he notates that. And usually it kind of corresponds because he's quite clever that way but uh, but but they need to relate and and all of that then sort of comes together the words and the music to develop the the situation that the characters in